you. Uh, now you notice there's a bit of activity down here uh, near the keyboard because uh, Irene, our accompanist for many, many years, has just been quite poorly. So she's been missing uh, from quite for a, a short time as she could manage <laughs> uh, in hospital and determined to come back today to play for the choir for one or two pieces this afternoon. So she said, I'm going to play my favourites next. Um, we only been doing this next one quite a short time. It's called If We Only Have the Love by Jack Brett.
Um, we'd like to sing now a, a song about a young lad that left his mining family and eventually began to miss him so much he wanted to be back home again. It's called Take Me Home.
It's very hard to appear when an hour and Barry Tozic has to sit down for a bit. That's why I'm disappearing. I, mean, I think he's all right. And now we have Stephen back with us. Stephen is our assistant accompanist. And he's been helping us an awful lot uh, over the past few rehearsals while Irene's been otherwise engaged. Uh, so we're very pleased that Stephen, who is one of our second tenants, by the way, is here today. Although we, we're missing the second tenant now. But anyway, thank you, Stephen. Uh, this is one that we, we tried to help for the first time of the day, isn't it? Yeah. yeah do, do you remember? It, it might be. Pardon? He'll jump on the next train now.
Julian and Derek come back to join the choir now. We'll come back to them later. Thank you. Now, while they're getting themselves sorted, I'll just tell you what, what's happening next. Because uh, usually, when the, the choir uh, does a concert, they're asked to do a particular piece of music, and they're asked to do a group of songs nearly every time we go in and sing anywhere at all. And it's a little selection from uh, the Miserable. This afternoon, we're going to do three items. That you hear the people sing, I dream the dream, and then the one I love to hear of that singing, bring him home. So we'll just bring those three out. So after this one, we'll be straight into the next.
Well, this, this year, um, we're commemorating the end of the, the First World War. It's the 100th anniversary from the end of the, the First World War, isn't it? And we thought we'd like to mark that occasion with a couple of items. The first one is a, a, a marching song from uh, Sigmund Romberg's operetta, The New Moon. And then we're going to move on to a, a piece called Song for the Unsung Hero. And again, we're going to have Ian uh, playing, a, sorry, not Ian, this time we'll have Derek playing the, the flute again. And we're going to be joined by Jess from our tenors who is going to be playing the, the drum. But, but first of all, we're going to sing Stout Hearted Men.
which is absolutely magnificent, but they're taking the roof down and they're lifting the floor up and they're repairing it. But that's why we're sitting there, so it's repaired. So really, we're quite pleased about that. We will be singing at Woodhouse, we will be singing in the Long Gallery, and the tickets are very, 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 very scarce. They're like rocky horse droppings, you don't see many. If you find a source for a ticket, and buy one, because it'll be a cracking night. Thank you.
we'll see uh, some of you, if not all of you, at some, some time again uh, when we do some of our other concerts, some of which you've heard about this afternoon. And I'd like to say a special word of thanks to uh, our soloists, to Ian and to Derek, and of course to our drummer, Jess. And our accompanist, Irene, who's limped here from her sick bed. It's very nice, Irene, for you to be able to come and take part in the concert. I didn't think you were going to be well enough, but it's been lovely, thank you. And of course to, uh, to, to Stephen, our uh, assistant accompanist. Thank you very much, Stephen. <laughs> and we're going to say a good afternoon to you all um, with a piece that's a, a favourite among, I think, most male voice choirs. It's another Elvis piece. In fact, it's three Elvis pieces all sewn together. It's called the American Trilogy.